Hello everyone, my name is Ed Henderson and I am the fellow student in the English Comp 100E and um, I graduated from high school back in 1985 and yes, I'm probably one of the senior class, or one, I'm sorry, one of the senior oldest student in the class, but hey, after a 37 year hiatus away from school, I am back returning to further my education. Um, just a little bit more about myself. I am a longshoreman. I work here in the port of Oakland, San Francisco. Uh, recently uh, been elected. Uh, I'm sorry, let me rephrase that. Formerly was elected as a five time business agent and a two time secretary treasurer for the union itself. So, um, with that being said, just moving along a little bit about. The topic itself how my brain works um, with stress or with anger um, there are a few key things that tend to uh, have me react to in a negative way and that was one it will be disrespectful individuals bullies and then I hate to bring up politics but yes indeed politics um, as a youngster, uh, I used to be a fireball. I mean, anything that that was aggressive toward me, I reacted in sometime in a volatile way or verbal. And um, it took many years for me to learn how to adapt and find better solutions. But as I've gotten older in life, um, I was able to, I guess, restructure that. But however, I have certain barriers that allow certain things to get up under my skin and then I will react. And as I stated at the beginning, of dis I do not, I dislike disrespectful individuals, um, whether you're grown or a child. I think children should respect their elders. Um, in today's society, you see a lot of children running around the streets, cursing, uh, disrespecting adults, um, doing things that's just completely out of pocket, um, fighting, you know, drinking, smoking weed out in public, uh, men, uh, I mean, the boys with their pants hanging off their behind, the young ladies with their belly button showing and piercing. Um, not that it's not a good thing to do, but in my opinion, as a father that has a daughter that I would not allow, um, I think that that's sacred. Um, showing your belly button with a piercing as a underage teenager um, is something um, that sh should wait to you an adult. That's just my opinion. And you young ladies that's in this course do not take this um, without a grain of salt. I'm just stating the fact for my daughter and what my beliefs are. Um, bullies, I dislike bullies um, because of the fact that they can take advantage of individuals um, and can cause some serious trauma to them, which could lead to suicide. And uh, in today's society, um, a lot of kids cannot cope with pressure and stress anymore, um, especially post-COVID. Uh, suicide rates has been up like about 18% in juveniles. So I do not like bullies, and that's one of the reasons why um, that me growing up as a kid, I was a late bloomer. I didn't start getting any size on me to my uh, freshman year, sophomore year in college. So um, I was always, I know how to take care of myself, but a lot of people who don't. Um, so that's another thing. Now, again, to the political field that really ticks me off is our most recent presidential campaign right now. Um, for those of you who did not uh, watch it tonight, but I believe it was a complete travesty uh, with this presidential debate tonight with the um, the GOP side and uh, don't want to list names because that individual name and just the thought of that individual just makes me cringe. He was completely unhinged tonight making, making comments uh, in regards to things that this didn't make sense. You know, hide your pets because everyone is coming to eat your cats and dog. But um, some of the things he's stated was just unbelievable so um being all that said is that uh from the t 
the uh, the readings uh, to be black in America with a learning disability. Um, one of my annotations from it was being black in America is already hard on its own because the roots of systemic racism. And and I only use that because in this race for president, uh, the the Republican uh, individual that's running for president made comments in regards to the Madam Vice President right now uh, regarding her uh, ethnicity. And he makes a mockery of it. And I think that's very disrespectful, uh, one, to not only her being a, a woman of color, but to try and state whether she's an African-American or Jamaican or Indian. Uh, I think that that's just very petty and that really just gets me unhinged at times too. So, but anyway, I just wanted to share that and what I think uh, in regards to how my, my brain works personally because it can get all over the place with certain things. And I believe that, like I said, disrespectful individuals, bullies, and the way our political world is ran, it's something that I have to keep a firm grasp on. So other than that, thank you for your time, and I hope that this should suffice this lesson. Thank you.